The unexpected news of the shooting death of Bishop David O'Connell on February 18th in Los Angeles shook the community. Immediately after, people made memorials outside his house and began paying their respects. For the Archdiocese of L.A., Bishop O'Connell was more than a spiritual father. He was a friend. Bishop Dave was a man for all people, sort of like St. Paul. We hear St. Paul being all things for all people, and he had a way of receiving people who were in their most vulnerable and neediest moments, but uh, simultaneously was a community leader. You know, he worked uh, with city council, he worked with the police department, with the sheriff's department, uh, was involved in a lot of civil movements as well. Father Jonathan and Father Brian both knew the bishop when he was simply Father Dave. Before being ordained a bishop, he was the pastor in a violent gang neighborhood. He would find people in the streets and give them work. But for these two young priests, he was also someone who helped them discern their vocation. During the year Father Jonathan spent serving at St. Michael's, a local parish, Bishop O'Connell gave him the push he needed to fully commit to the priesthood. And it was in that year at St. Michael's, uh, I think especially through his witness, through his love, um, through his, his faith and devotion to the Lord, that kind of gave me that, that bit of impetus, that last sort of push to say, Fiat, yes, I'll, I, I will do your will, Lord. Bishop O'Connell's work with the various groups in the community earned him the name the Peacemaker. You know, I think that's a great name for him. I think the Archbishop gave him that name in his statement. And I just, I think it's perfect, not just because of all the social work and a lot of the things he did in the community, which he did a ton, but in that interpersonal way where he would love you even in the midst of your acting out. He, he, he would look at you with love. The Archdiocese of Los Angeles is holding three days of memorial services beginning on March 1st and ending on March 3rd. Bishop David O'Connell will be laid to rest in the Cathedral of Our Lady of the Angels on March 4th. Pour out that love.